Hello, <clears throat> Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, today's date, it's uh, July 15th of 2021, and I just finished some lasagna from the oven. Uh, and my computer just did an update. <clears throat> I'm running uh, Windows 11. So it just did uh, two updates. Uh, one of them was a uh, cumulative, cumulative update for Net Framework 3.5 and 4.8 for Windows 11. And then it did a uh, cumulative update for Windows and it's uh, <clears throat> 10.0.2200.71. So, let's see what we have. Now, this is for Windows 11, remember. This is the development channel, and I don't recommend that uh, you be doing that. So, it's KB. 504252 Windows 11 Insider Preview Development Build 10.0.2200.71 And as I said, today's date is July 15th. And it says, Hello Windows Insiders. Today we are releasing Windows 11 Insider Preview Build 22. 000.71 to everyone in the development channel. Exclamation point. Changes and improvements. We're introducing a new entertainment widget. The entertainment widget allows you to see new featured movie titles available in the Microsoft Store. Selecting a movie will direct you to the Microsoft Store to see more information about that title. Just open the widgets and click on or tap on the Add Widgets button and choose the Entertainment Widget. Okay. Not really interested, but... The new Entertainment Widget gives you quick access to featured movie titles in the Microsoft Store. Okay. So I guess this is what it looked like before. And here's what it looks like now. The new Windows 11 context menu, before acrylic and after. We're testing the usability of a split button for making new folders and files in the File Explorer command bar. The taskbar preview, when you mouse over open apps on the taskbar has been updated to reflect the new visual design of Windows 11. Let's go down here and see if, let's see, okay, I guess that, is this new? Uh, I don't know if that's new or not. Okay, fixes. Taskbar previews with rounded corners. Okay, fixes. Taskbar. We fixed an issue where if you drag an app icon on the taskbar to rearrange them, it was making the apps launch or minimize when you release the icon. Using a long press with touch on an icon app icon in the taskbar to open the jump list would now should now work. After right clicking the start icon in the taskbar, clicking somewhere else would now dismiss the menu more reliably. Uh, uh, anyway, look, I'll, I'll put a link to this. You can read it yourself. Settings. We fixed an issue making settings crash on launch 
periodically. I think I had that actually happen the other day. We fixed an issue with making settings crash on launch periodically. I think I had that happen the other day. And then it said, you know, informing Microsoft of the problem. Using the volume mixer sliders and sound settings should be more responsive now, as well as the page responsiveness as a whole. We fixed an issue resulting in disk and volume settings. Maybe I should just do this for a little bit here. Uh, where was I? We fixed an issue resulting the disk and volume settings change size option being clipped. There was a non-functional functional verify link under backup settings that has now been fixed. The power and battery settings pages should no longer be reporting a battery saver is engaged in its, in its not. And blah, blah, blah. We fixed a grammatical error in the sign-in settings text. Uh, the I forgot my pin link was unexpectedly missing in sign-in settings with a pin that was set up and has now been returned. Excuse me, lasagna. Uh, blah, 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 blah. We addressed an issue where some of the elements of a theme page and settings would end up crowded together when the window size was small. Uh, okay, File Explorer fix, okay. Viral Explorer fixed, okay. Widgets, when using the Outlook client with a Microsoft account calendar and to do updates should sync faster now, down to the widgets. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Other, oh, my arthritis is bugging me having to sit here and, uh, Look at this. Okay, blah, 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 blah. We have a fly in here now, and they are, it's only one in here, but he's, a, he's aggressive. Uh, known issues. When upgrading to Windows 11 from Windows 10, or when installing an update to Windows 11, some features may be depreciated or removed. Start. Okay, I'll... I'm going to put the link, you know, put the link to all this, File Explorer, Search, Widget Store, for Developers, Insider Links. Okay, that's it. That's it. Okay. Um, I'm using Manicam. I have both my monitors going. 1080p mode. I have both cameras going the C920 and the Brio going and I have the my Panasonic G7 and I have the tripod here and I think I'm going to try that also hooking it back up I did that for a while and I'm not sure if that will replace one of these two cameras or if it'll be an additional. So we will, we'll see. 
Uh, let's see what else is going on. Uh, uh, I'm going to take a nap. I took an naproxen for my arthritis pain, so I'm, well, I'm going to start the upload on this. And then I'm going to take a nap, so uh, thank you very much for watching.